a lot of breeds were created, especially during Victorian times, by mixing and matching different breeds. And after catastrophic world events like World War II, a lot of breeds had to be recreated. And I can now tell you from my ribbon plot exactly how that happened. And I can also tell you the time frame in which it happened. So I can plot how many years ago or how many generations ago, this is actually in years, big events happened. Okay, so in my world, the big event is when the Norfolk and the Norwich Terrier split. <laughs> that was huge for me. And that happened about 40 years ago. The Chow Chow began the Eurasian development. Okay, that's going to be here about 50 years ago. Um, we had to recreate the Irish Wolfhound from the Scottish Deerhound in, in Europe following these catastrophic events about 80 years ago. The Silky Terrier created from the Yorkie and the Australian Terrier. The German short hair, the wire hair pointing Griffon, I know that's one that you all love. Um, they went, went together to make the German wire hair pointer, which is absolutely a lovely, lovely breed. Um, and then we can tell pretty complex stories, like the Bulldog, the French Bulldog, and the American Staffordshire came together to create the Boston Terrier about 150 years ago. 